just some updates on what's been happening with the virus and everything here in Korea. Um, so as it stands, school is actually being um, delayed again and this time they're delaying it until April 6th and that's because there are still some concerned parents. I mean the numbers here are still going up but it has slowed down so it's not as many people getting sick but there are still illnesses out there. When you walk around town now a lot of people you might see quite a few people who don't have their masks on anymore but you also see other people giving them like this. Um, because nobody wants to catch it um, and that's pretty much it you know there's everything's going in lockdown I got the notification from the New Zealand Embassy um, with a strong travel warning and a very strong suggestion that any New Zealanders overseas should consider going home and uh, Australia and New Zealand have now locked down their borders to international uh, foreigners and travelers coming in but as a citizen I should still be able to go into both of those countries if I need to um, but then that all depends on commercial flights and right now I think I'm in a pretty safe place so being here in Korea is pretty safe for me and there's lots of toilet paper but you know we'll be able to go down in history as the generation that hoarded toilet paper yep well done <laughs> It's actually a bit embarrassing because my my Korean friends they'll send me messages and stuff. I'm not on Facebook very often, um, so they send me messages through Cow Talk, and I get memes and things about the toilet paper situations in Australia. It's not so bad in New Zealand yet, and um, in America as well with people just buying lots of toilet paper, and I'm like. Dude, what is wrong with you? Buy something essential. I mean, when it comes down to it, you can wash your butt. But if you've got no food, then you can't eat that toilet paper. Serious. Um, hmm. Okay, a lot of newspaper companies though, probably wishing they hadn't gone digital. <laughs> You'd make a lot of money once the TP's all gone. In, in these apartment buildings, we have a speaker up on the wall. Mine is in the kitchen. And every now and then we'll hear an announcement coming through from security just to let us know that uh, something is happening. And the latest one has been to let us know when we can go down to the community center to get free masks. Unfortunately, I'm a foreigner. So uh, in the first coronavirus video I did, I mentioned that they didn't have my name on the list and that made it difficult. Well, they still don't have a foreign list, which means you're not actually catered for now. Now they're doing it building by building and they're actually only giving them out to Korean citizens right now. And anybody else will have to wait for the announcement to say that you can go get masks. So my Korean is not to the level where I can just understand the notices when they come through because they speak very quickly and so I usually contact my co-teacher let him know an announcement was made and he contacts the office to find out what it is and how it applies to me so I'm lucky that I can do that with my co-teacher but not every foreign teacher here has the same luxury um, another thing that is also happening is that if you want to buy a face mask now, so they've actually put set days at the chemist for when you want to go buy a face mask. And of course you still have to get in there early because they do go really fast. But what they've done is um, they have a schedule. So if your birth year ends in a certain number, obviously between zero and nine, um, there are certain days of the week that you can go in. So say um, 1 and 9 you can go in on Monday, 2 and 8 Tuesday and so forth. So I'll just post it here so you can see how it happens. And if you miss out during the week then you can go in on the weekend and um, buy a mask then. But I guess you you probably have to prove that your your birth date and everything else but also that you haven't actually bought a mask during the week 
I'm not sure because I missed out. Today is my day, so today is the day that I should be going in to get a mask. But um, I had a family thing to attend early this morning, so I wasn't able to go down to the chemist. And tomorrow's, you know, maybe I'll be able to go on the weekend or something. Um, last weekend I missed out because it, it, it was just sold out so early. The chemist opened at 8.30 and by 9 they were all gone. So the mask situation, people are still buying up masks really quickly. And um, yeah, I still have a few so I'm not in the panic area yet. Um, but yep, yeah, those are the updates. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm gonna get going now, but you guys have a good day. Bye.